All right, in this video, we're going to be doing the HDP again. And we got the, the CO2 canister is inside there. And instead of 850 PSI, we're going to be using 1100. And I believe I got 30, it was 30 joules with this 8.4 steel gram bearings. And yeah, around 30 joules. So I think, see if we can get it up higher with 1100 PSI. Just trying to put less pressure on that that seal because with the full plenum it's just way too much air volume but anyways we'll see what happens <clears throat> okay got a same thing a half inch of plywood again or sorry a full inch of plywood there's two sheets back there Okay, let's try the slide check. Oh, see if this makes any difference. Three sixty four. Three forty nine. Three forty five. And a duplicate. Okay, shut that off. And let's just take a quick peek at the at the. Uh, I don't think those went through. Oh, they went through the first one. Oh, wait a minute, did they? Yeah, a couple of them did. I don't know, man. There's so many fucking holes on there now. I don't know which one's which, <clears throat> but I'm just basically testing the HPA today, the air, and see if I get any increases from the 1100 PSI, and looks like we did. <clears throat> 